Hey guys, Argon Alligator here, and I just want to say thank you so much for helping me reach 30,000 subscribers. That's a huge milestone for me. And uh, in celebration of that, I figured I would go ahead and do one of those fancy comment reading videos. Uh, where I read some weird or funny or interesting comments that I've collected over the years of running this channel. Um, some of them are pretty out there. So without further ado, let's get to the comments. Our first comment comes in from Sure, who asks, Argyle, have you ever smack a guy like a woman? No, Sure, I don't think I've ever smack a guy like a woman. Uh, maybe I'm not living my life to the fullest, because uh, I don't think I've ever had the chance to experience this. Uh, if you have, please let us know in the comments below and how it felt. Let's go on to the next comment here. This one's by Arumba08. Uh, this was on my Rust musical video, and it says, The more I hear your voice, the more I want to have sex with it. Not you, just your voice. Beautifully stated. I also gave it a thumbs up along with 11 other people from two years ago, so I must have agreed with that statement. But thank you, Arumba, for the kind, kind words. Uh, we got the Darebarius coming in. Asking, did he end up turning you into a baby and eating you afterwards? I'm not really sure if this was in reference to anything. <laughs> it seemed to come out of left field. I'm not really sure. But, you know, uh, I'm going to have to say no. Because I don't believe any of that's ever happened to me or anyone in general. But thank you for your input, uh, Debarius. Then we have Spookwagon the Second telling me I have a mediocre phallus. I've also upped this. Give it a thumbs up, so I must have agreed with it. Alright, this one is a little bit of a long one, so uh, here we go. It's from Funny Skelly, and this was on the uh, one of the Pizza Man videos, so here we go. What the fuck did you just fucking say about me, you little pizza? I'll have you know I graduated top of my class in pizza school, and I've been involved in numerous secret raids on Totino's Pizza, and have over 300 confirmed pizza deliveries. I am trained in pizza warfare and the top pizza deliverer in the entire U.S. Armed Forces. You are nothing to me but another order. I will wipe your hunger the fuck out with precision the likes which have never been seen before on this earth. Mark my fucking words. You think you can get away with ordering a pizza from me over the internet? Think again, fucker. As we speak, I am contacting my secret network of pizza shops across the USA, and your IP is being traced right now, so you better prepare for the storm, maggot. The storm that wipes out the puny little things you call your hunger. You're fucking hungry, kid. I can be anywhere, anytime, and I can deliver a pizza to you in over 700 ways, and that's just with my bare hands. Not only am I extensively trained in unarmed pizza delivery, but I have access to the entire arsenal of the United States Pizza Corps, and I will use it to its full extent to wipe out your miserable hunger off the face of the continent, you little shit. If only you could have known what unholing retribution your little pizza order was about to bring down upon you, maybe you would have held your fucking tongue. But you couldn't. You didn't. And now you're paying the price of a large pie, you goddamn idiot. I will shit pizza all over you and drown you in it. You're fucking dead, kiddo. That was beautiful, funny skeleton. That was just goddamn beautiful. I don't know if I've ever seen anything more beautiful when it comes to eliciting a threat with the involving of a, a good old pizza delivery. Beautiful. On to the next one. So this one was uh, on another one of my Pizza Man videos, and I thought it was funny because <laughs> the guy just advertises his pizza joint, Gianfranco Pizza Rustica, Philadelphia, PA, uh, to which I respond... Very simply, Fresh Pizza, Fresh Pete's, Third of Market Street, Rust Island. So, that'll teach you to advertise your fucking pizzas on my pizzas. Uh, this one I wanted to include just because it seems like a general consensus. Argyle sounds like Paul Rudd. I don't know why people keep thinking I sound like Paul Rudd. I don't hear it, but I it must be there because it, uh, a large amount of people keep saying it. So I just wanted to address it. Uh, Great Boy adds in a classic line, Doctors don't know shit about Mars. <laughs> I, I guess it depends on what kind of doctor you're talking about, but I'll take, I'll take your word for it because you seem like a great boy who knows what he's talking about with that big old suit. 
suit's a little big. Uh, we got here from Riley McKay saying, Dear Argyle, hi, my name is Suzanne, and I am from the company of TJ Hooker. If you are interested in a job, I have looked into your videos, and we're offering you a trial job as a house seller slash negotiator. If you are interested, please reply, and I will give you an address to meet up and discuss what the pay and your hours. Thanks, Suzanne. This was on my home appraiser video, and uh, at first I thought it might have been a bot just going off search results, but holy fuck, the spelling and grammar is atrocious throughout this entire thing. So I'm assuming it's either somebody who has some problems, or it's somebody who's a child trying to be funny. Also, the name is Riley, but they claim their name is Suzanne. So, uh, good job. It entertained me, at least. Uh, this one was on the party bus video for Arma 3, and, uh, the person... This was a real ad that I think was a bot. Love the video, great party bus limos, and then links their fucking limo bus. So, uh, if you ever need a limo, hit this guy up, apparently. Jesus Christ, I, <laughs> I can't believe I get advertisement bots on my videos. Uh, I don't know how to say his name. Ang Angtatarius1 says, don't comment on this comment, and I didn't, so there you go. Abided your wishes. And then Awesome Dude says, you really do have a face for radio. Couldn't have said it better myself. Uh, this was on my Rust Radio videos. No face cam. But, uh, thank you for your input. Eater of Carpets. Sorry, I go, but the whole shrimp thing isn't funny anymore. To which I respond, I think that's a matter of shrimp opinion. To which someone else responds, nobody gives a shrimp what you think. Beautiful. Just, uh, I love my subscribers. You guys are fantastic. All right, we got another one here from UC Beats. Surprisingly accurate growing there. I would not recommend planting several seeds in the same container, as the roots would end up fighting and disease could spread fast. Lol, tongue face. Uh, this was on a video where I was growing virtual weed, but, uh, here's some advice if you're growing real weed, and thank you to UC Beats for, uh, your, um, your botany lesson that you provided to us. Cat Ghost has replied, This made me think about what hundreds of men running around naked smelled like, and now I'm slightly traumatized. Well, I'm sorry, Cat Ghost, that, uh, that happened to you. I can assure you, from my time in Rust, it doesn't smell that bad. It's it's tolerable. It's tolerable. Billy Singh, I want to rape you with anal toys. Look at that face. God. Billy, you seem like such a nice kid. Why would you say that? What's wrong with you? Here we go from uh, Bubba Gert here. This was a recent comment. Argyle. It's, it's addressed to me, so I'm saying Argyle. I heard you were a lesbian, Argyle. I hope that isn't true, because I have a shrine in my closet of you. I wanted to mate, because I also live in the swamp. But I guess since you're a lesbian now, I have to go back to school, and come home on time, and pay for my bus fare, instead of asking for a free ride. And train old ladies to help other old ladies cross the street, and fill the cookie jar with scorpions, and put salt into the pepper shaker, and pepper into the salt shaker at restaurants. Especially Denny's, because fuck Denny's. Their food gives me the runs. I swear to God, I hope you're not eating at Denny's, because our babies would come out retarded and weigh like seven pounds, ripping my dick apart. Thank you, Baba Gert, for that beautiful inflection. Um, yes, it's true, I am a lesbian. I'm sorry to, to break that and come out here on the news. Well, that's it for comments, everyone. Thank you once again for helping me reach 30,000 subscribers. I hope this channel can continue to grow and possibly get 31,000 subscribers, maybe 32, who knows what will happen in the future, but I hope all you guys stick with me, I hope my videos can continue to entertain you, uh, and we'll see what the future holds for youtube.com slash user slash argyalgator. Thank you guys once again. Go ahead and subscribe if you like the video, and if you really like this one, you should watch all the rest of my other videos. I've got all these different social media outlets that I use occasionally. You can follow them if you want to get in contact with me. Thanks everybody, and I'll see you next time.